The So Right Original versus the So Spine. Hey, what's up guys, it's Josh here. Today I want to basically do a new review on this So Spine, kind of like an extension of the So Right. Now I did do a video on the So Right. I said that it was the best deep tissue massager that I've ever tried and it kind of still stands up to this day. There has been some times where I've gone a little time without using it, but I seem to always come back to it and every single time that I have a knot, this is absolutely my favorite. So wanting to explore more products in their line, I tried out the So Spine. So I'm kind of going to go over the pros and cons of each one. So let's go over the So Spine over the pros of this one. There's honestly a good amount of pros and cons to each one. And I'll say which one is better for which person at the end. So the pros of the So Spine is that it is much easier to use than the So Right. The So Right is kind of like a deep tissue tissue tool and most of the time you can't really match up both these to both be on deep tissue points so you're really just using one of these to basically really flush out a knot and it's not really the easiest to balance on it's not really the easiest to just ah uh, just lay on it and have it do its job this one so much easier to use so much less intense than the so right for me i personally like the intensity of the so right but i had one of my relatives lay on this and they kind of freaked out and was like that's way too strong like i would never lay on that again and i'm like well you haven't tried the so right because the so right is probably like two or three times more of like a digging action than that but so it's a little bit less intense while still Still being probably a little bit more intense than the average product because this is a very very good muscle relief tool well this one's better for the spine duh because it is called the so spine it is just a really really nice thing to straighten out your spine I feel like this is better for posture as well too I almost think with everybody and the way we live our lives nowadays you're gonna have some kink somewhere in your back and with these things, it's just, it's hitting everything and kind of making sure you activate those muscles and you're using every muscle in your back so that you don't overuse one muscle and then un underuse another one that happens quite a bit. So very, very good for the spine, very good for posture, better for the spine and better for the posture than the so right, I will say them. You can also lay on this one for a long time. I actually think I fell asleep once once or twice, put, you know, laying on this. It's just a lot easier for you to kind of just lay on and forget what you're doing or just hang out for a little bit. The so right is a little bit more of you're getting in to do something to to fix something to flush something out and that's really it it's not really something you i could see somebody laying on or falling asleep it's for a specific tool and it's very very intense so that is kind of like the pros of the so spine you know very very good a little bit less intense while still being more intense i would say it's better for posture and better for the spine i do think this is worth purchasing if you really really like the so right and you want just kind of like an extra tool from the same company that is going to work very well i really do like like the so spine all right guys let's go into the so right now this one is pretty much one of my best tried and true um, muscle relief tools I kind of always end up coming back to this the second that I think that it's not gonna work I end up just trying a few different spots and I end up getting it to work definitely the biggest deep tissue relief that you could get almost guaranteed if you have a knot of any kind and you're able to get this so right under that and really leverage it i don't think there's any knot that you won't be able to get out which is absolutely great for having like a home relief tool such as this it took me a long long time to find out the psoas muscle the psoas muscle for me from what i found is it's kind of like it's like not your abs but it's not the side of your stomach and it's between your groin and your rib cage so it's just anything in there that's not your abs or the side of your obliques anyways long story short i started laying down on that it was a little bit weird at first a little bit intense having all this push right up in your gut you're kind of like it's a really weird feeling but i was very surprised that the psoas really was making my whole body tight <clears throat> I kind of have this lower back pain. It's kind of in the middle to lower back on both sides of my spine. And I kind of have had that for a while. And this, I was using this to flush those out. But for some reason, I would just really flush it out, get it in there in my back. But it would almost kind of like still be lingering there. Almost anytime my back's hurting, I could actually go after the psoas, lay it on my stomach. And actually, it's amazing that it really loosens up your whole body. I think the first couple of times I actually got the psoas, I just wanted to go right to sleep because 
because of how relaxed I felt. Another pro of this one, like I was saying, is that you actually hit the psoas for this one, whereas the so spine, you can't really hit it. But I feel like most people are gonna buy this for having some sort of back pain. And I think this is specifically designed for the back. If I had to pick one, for me personally, I would go with this because I have such big knots and I don't really have any other tool that's gonna do what this does, even though I like this. Look how short it is compared to that. This just digs in there no matter what. This isn't like a waste of a product. I actually really, really like this one and I'm gonna use it a lot. I'm just saying if I had to pick one, this one you get the psoas relief, whereas you don't get it here. And then this one you get the extreme deep tissue relief that you don't get in this one either. But to be honest guys, I really, really do like it. And I would say if you really like the so right, I would definitely check out the so spine and possibly pick it up. But like I said, it's so much easier to use. More people can use it. And it's just a nice mix up having both both of them you know if you want something really easy straighten your spine all that kind of good stuff you could lay on this one if you want something for extreme deep tissue relief go with the original so right so anyways guys that's been my little review on the so spine and the so right very very good tools some of the best tools that i've come across so far in the kind of back relief style genre of products i was really blown away by this one really really love it like i said if you're somebody with a lot of big knots a lot of deep tissue get this one and then if you like this one also get this or if you have somebody who thought this was way too intense but they also have back issues definitely pick this one up really durable i don't think you're gonna break it it's probably gonna last a long time really do enjoy these products they are kind of expensive i think they run about 70 to 80 dollars for these maybe this was i think i got this for about 60 and maybe i got this for about 60 or 70 a lot of money but when you consider you're pretty much paying for the testing that they've done to make these products and i've had this for i mean i don't know a year and it's just absolutely no sign of wear and tear or any problems at all i probably would get at least 10 years out of both these products so 10 years of back relief is pretty good for 60 70 dollars but anyways guys we're on the road to 25 000 subscribers and I couldn't do that. I need your guys' help because you guys are the best. I'm having a great day out here. Hopefully, I'm having a great day at home. See you all in the next video. Peace.